In this rapture the angel took me to the flower garden, where the children were playing in heaven, Zechariah 8 verse 5 and the streets of the city will be filled with boys and girls who will play in them, these were all the children who have not allowed themselves to be corrupted by social networks, games and television, then the angel led me to the archives hall. The angel and I entered the hall of mystery where are kept the archives of heaven, where there was files and record of everything that exist, I saw another angel writing things with a gold pen, and I asked my companion what the angel was doing, he told me, he is reporting about God's work on earth, and taking notes on the church and evangelistic and missionary work. He is also writing about the stages of the life of every Christian on the earth and about their spiritual growth. I noticed the angel that was writing the reports was really sad. My companion angel told me he is recording the loss of souls that were previously striving for the kingdom of heaven. Every time a pastor on the pulpit does not preach the truth, and is afraid to speak out against sin, the kingdom of heaven loses multitudes of souls to hell. But the more souls these shepherds win, the more precious stones are placed on their crown. However, the moment they hesitate to preach the truth, even these gemstones that were placed on their crown are removed until there is no stone left, and if they continue avoiding preaching the truth, the Lord will take away his crown and they will lose the right to reign with Christ, and will be condemned to hell. I did not understand what was written in books of the archives. The angel said, If you want to receive the mysteries of heaven from these books, you cannot come with human knowledge to receive secret and revelations. The books are more complete because they contain all the stories and secret of divine literary, on each book the name of the Father the Son and the Holy Spirit is present because they live in unity, my understanding was opened and letters of the heavenly language were translated into my language so that I could read these books, I have seen files and record related to peoples, churches, mysteries of things that are to come on earth and things that are already on earth, as for the bookstore in heaven. The Bible proves that in addition to the book of life there are many other books in heaven, the angel showed me the memorial book of the saints who do the will of God on the land, Malachi 3 verse 16 Then those who feared the Lord spoke to one another, and the Lord listened and heard them, so a book of memorial was written before him for those who fear the Lord and who meditate on his name, so it is not just the book of life that is in heaven, otherwise knowledge would be limited. If there are millions of books of knowledge on earth, how much more they are in heaven, the heavenly world is above and superior to earth in knowledge, holiness and eternal life, in the hall of archive and mystery, I saw books that reveal all the angelic hierarchy that dwells in heaven and how each angel serve God, I learn about classes of angel for they are a great variety many classes of angels from the smallest to the largest, I saw a book that tells of the life of Lucifer and how he lived before the rebellion and his fall from faith. The angel promised to reveal to me Lucifer life when we reach the revelations of the angelic world I will speak on these mystery, in the archive hall I have seen files of the creation of planet of our solar system, I saw archives of the construction of the celestial city and of all the species of heavenly world including animals and plants of the kingdom of God. The angel told me, your mind is limited and unable to contain all these secret, even if my mind is more expanded than yours, I do not have the full knowledge of all these mysteries. The angel took the book of my life and he showed the trajectory of my life. I was sad because all my disobedience was written and when I was a Mormon and practiced false religion in that sect, and even though I was converted and gathered in the assembly of God my life was crooked, the pages of my story are sad and all the pages had only sin because of crooked paths, wrong decisions and choices without God's direction, and there was only one sheet where it was written about my walk in holiness and it was the last page written when I made reconciliation with God. I asked the angel why there is only one sheet of holiness walk, more than half of the book is about sins and only one page of my story that pleases God, the evidence is against me and I will be condemned, I began to cry before the angel knowing that this would be used in the final judgment against me. The angel said this single page is enough to justify you woman of God because your repentance that is on that sheet has nullified more than half of this book. There is no condemnation for those who are in Christ Jesus. 
The angel said this last page that Justify You was written in your first experience when you were snatched to heaven in the year 2020, and when you returned to earth you repented of your sins and renounced everything with sincere heart, as a result more than half of the book lost its validity, Jesus already does not remember your past. The angel took another book that talks about my life and in this new book it was written, born on April 16, 2020 a one-year-old pure child. The angel said your life began in the celestial world after your rapture when you decided to live a separated life for God and renounced the world, I cried when I saw that I was only one year in heaven, no one can see the kingdom of God unless he is born again, and I had another name in heaven, I didn't know how to pronounce my new name, the lyrics were not translated into my language, Genesis 17 verse 5 your name will be Abraham for I have made you a father of many nations, just as a loving father names his child with a new name, the heavenly name is a new identity and it is a covenant with the eternal God that will take you to heaven, my companion angel said he could not know my new name because it was a mystery, when I die and enter the heavenly world I will know my new name, the angel showed me the book of my ministry, and he said your first and real ministry is starting, you'll be an evangelist and everything written in this book about your ministry you will do on earth, it is written, for we are God's workmanship, created in Christ Jesus to do good works, which God prepared in advance as our way of life, the book of ministry is a spiritual direction, path and trajectory of your ministry, how will you live on earth serving God and doing good works which God has prepared in advance, I ask the angel, how am I going to know what to do on earth if I don't know what is written in that book for my ministry? The angel said from now on, ask God to guide you in what you will do on earth and ask the Holy Spirit to guide you in how you will carry out your evangelistic ministry, the Spirit of God will guide you. Most Christians do God's work not God's way, but their way, they behave as if they own the work of God, the ministries they exercise do not follow the set trajectory. They do not align with what is written in the book of ministries, some are anointed to be pastors on earth, but in the book of ministries in heaven it says they are deacon, others have a call from God to be missionaries, but they are guardians of the church, those who are supposed to be preaching the word of God they are just praising and singing, and the angel showed me many ministerial books that are written with works that every Christian had to do on earth. Psalm 139 verse 16 Your eyes saw my unformed body, all my days were written in your book and ordained for me before one of them came to be, in the hall of archive and mystery I have seen mystery books that have not yet been revealed to men, and also books containing secret of the creation of the universe, the stars, the planet, the moon, the sun, the galaxies and other universal bodies that scientists will never discover and will take hundreds of years to discover, they discover only 1% of outer space, they are ignorant about the nature of planets and also the things from the bottom of the sea and the plants that cure the worst diseases, if men cannot discover even the mysteries of nature and his creation how they will discover the mysteries of God who is in heaven, and how they will know that there is a hell. In the Hall of Mystery and Archive I saw the book that recorded the works that Jesus did on earth, but it is not recorded in the Bible, there are also many other things which Jesus did, the which if they should be written everyone, I suppose that even the world itself could not contain the books that should be written, John 20 verse 30 and 31 Jesus did other many signs in the presence of his disciples which are not written in this book but these mighty works have been written so that you may believe that Jesus is the Christ the Son of God and so that believing you may have life in his name, in the archive hall, the angel showed me the chest of mystery with various scrolls containing the hidden secrets not yet revealed to humanity, I told the angel if I would be ready to receive the hidden revelations that are in the chest of mystery, the angel replied that your mind would not sustain these secret and you will go crazy with so much mystery and that no one would believe you. The secret hidden in the chest of mysteries in our absurd to human understanding, in this hall of secret, I saw in a big golden box that had various grades of Christian men and women, and I asked the angel what are for these grades and degrees, and what they are. The angel said these are diplomas of the saints of the earth. A lot of Christian are tested and tried, finally they have graduated from spiritual training in their walk with the Lord, 
other have failed the test after training, and are stagnating, those who have passed from their test and trials are graduated, and the God of all grace, who called you to his eternal glory in Christ, after you have suffered a little while, will himself restore you and make you strong, firm and steadfast, when Christians on earth strive to live a holy life, they receive these training from the Holy Spirit, those who pass the test and trial receive diplomas and degree in the celestial world for leadership position. The angel said, when God raises up his shepherds on earth in order to work with them, first the Lord trained them and test them, when they are graduated in heaven and they become ready to exercise their ministries on earth, dear friends, do not be surprised at the fiery ordeal that has come on you to test you, as though something strange were happening to you. Blessed is the one who perseveres under trial because, having stood the test, that person will receive the crown of life that the Lord has promised to those who love him, in the hall of mysteries I also saw a library of books of knowledge about the wonders of God and all kinds of spiritual knowledge, and I saw the courtroom in which were the books of judgment, I saw the trial books on the shelves, there are written the deeds and sins of the wicked. I also saw the book of life with the names of faithful Christians, Revelation 20 verse 12, I saw the dead great and small standing before God and the books were opened and another book was opened on which is the book of life, and the dead were judged by the things that were written in the books according to their works, and were judged every one according to his works, and the one that was not found registered in the book of life was thrown into the lake of fire. Psalm 69 verse 28 say that the names of the wicked be blotted out of the book of the living and not be written with the righteous, Psalm 95 you have rebuked the nations, you have destroyed the wicked, you have blotted out their name forever and ever, Exodus 32 verse 32 and 33 the Lord replied to Moses, whoever has sinned against me I will blot out of my book. It is written he who overcomes will be clothed in white robes and by no means I will erase her name from the book of life, and all the inhabitants of the earth whose names are not written in the book of life of the Lamb were cast to the lake of fire, Daniel 12 verse 1 and at that time Michael will raise up the great prince who is on the side of the children of your people and it will be a time of anguish such as never was since there were people until then but at that time your people will be delivered, all who are found written in the book. Apocalypse 21 27 and nothing will enter it that contaminates and do abomination and lies but only those who are written in the book of the life of the Lamb Apocalypse 22 19 and if anyone removes any word from the book of this prophecy, God will remove his part of the book of life and of the holy city and of the things that are written in this book, in the hall of mysteries I saw the book of the seven seals. Apocalypse 5 verse 1 And I saw in the right hand of him who sat on the throne a book written inside and out sealed with seven seals This book is very thick and it was already open and it had seven chapters that correspond to each seal, and the book had already passed half of the chapters and it was already halfway through the book, and I was on chapter 4 and its pages went to chapter 5 and the angel said each page of this book will be fulfilled on earth and what is written on its pages will be manifested on earth, I saw the next page, and the angel said this next page will be the next event of this prophecy, I saw that on the next page was written it is persecution against the church and I saw martyrs all over the world, do not fear what you are about to suffer, behold, the devil is about to throw some of you into prison, that you may be tested and for ten days you will have tribulation, be faithful unto death, and I will give you the crown of life. He who has an ear, let him hear what the Spirit says to the churches, the one who conquers will not be hurt by the second death, Revelation 2 verse 10 11.